this is Lauren Lori's cooking vlog. Say hi to everyone. Hi, how are you with you, baby? Can you tell them Happy Valentine's? Happy New Year's. No, not New Year's. Say Valentine. Hi. Val? Yeah. In time. Hi. Valentine. Hi. Now, tonight we're going to make chocolate covered strawberries. Remember, we are doing a keto blog. So, this is for people that um, are watching their sugar intake. This is also good for diabetics. And it is also good for celiac and um, gluten intolerant people. So what we have here is uh, Lily's dark chocolate. It's a candy bar out. And this one here has coconut in it. And we're just gonna put a few pieces of that in. And then we have Lily's Dark Chocolate, and this is made with stevia, so there's 55% uh, cocoa, and it's vegan and non-GMO. We're just going to put a few chips in there. Now this is the easiest way to do it. We're going to stick it in the microwave, and we're just going to melt it. Did you take a chocolate chip? Uh, uh, uh. Okay, so we have it melted. As you can see, it's sort of thick. So, I'm going to put a little bit of coconut oil in it to thin it up a little bit. About one teaspoon. Let's see how it melts here. So we can get it to the right consistency. Put the fork down, Laura, please. Thank you. Good listening skills. As you can see, that's pretty much to the right consistency we want. Okay. So now, what we're going to do is we're going to take our strawberries. Thank you for sitting down. Mommy doesn't want you to hurt yourself, okay? So, now what we're gonna do is we're gonna take our strawberries, like this, wait until Mommy tells you, okay? Hold it by the stem. We're gonna dip it as much as you can. And then you're gonna put it on the plate, like that, okay? You try one, okay? Here, hold it by the stem. Okay, yeah, hold it by the stem. For her, I'm helping her a little bit. Is it hot? Yeah. Yeah, it's hot. Good. So, and as you can see, you can also use a spoon if you want. There, we're gonna let them harden. Mom. You want to grab another strawberry for mommy? Mommy, I did high. Hmm? A high. What? A high. You want to try again? Okay, go ahead. Remember, hold it by the stem. Otherwise, your finger's going to get burnt. Hold it here by the stem. Okay, now dip it in. No, just dip it down. Yeah, let's get it all there. See? So as you can see, this is the one where we're using the Lily's chocolate. Now, Lily's chocolate is expensive. So one candy bar is three to five dollars, depending on what store you go to. And the chocolate chips is uh, between six and seven dollars. So Quite expensive. So if you don't want to spend that kind of money, but you want chocolate covered strawberries, not a problem. I'm going to show you a different way to do it. And this way is an expensive way. Get some Hershey's chocolate. 
we have the cocoa here, which is 100% special dark. Now you can use the other if you want, but if you're doing keto, I don't really think you want to do that. So I'm going to put in here about an eighth of a cup because this is a fourth cup. So I'm putting about an eighth of a cup in there. And then have the coconut oil. We're going to put some of that in there. We're going to put about, maybe not quite two teaspoons. You can always add more, but if you have too much coconut oil, then you have to add more coconut powder. And then we have two different kinds of zero calorie sugar here. We have pure xy xylitol powder. It's a plant-based, or we have this swerve. Now the swerve is uh, anywhere between uh, six and eight dollars at the stores or online. The xylitol powder is a little bit cheaper, I believe. Um, this one here we bought at Puritan Pride. So this is to sweeten the chocolate. So we're gonna take a spoon here and we're just gonna put we're going to mix it. So we're going to put one teaspoon of that in there. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you sure can. Wait a minute. Here. Here. Here, go ahead. Put that down. And we're going to put one teaspoon of the swirl. Okay. Oh, wait, wait. Now we're going to put it in the microwave just until it's melted. Okay. Now, this one here is melted. This is the consistency. It is going to be a little bit liquidy and it's very hot. Very, very hot. So, and as you can see, it's darker too because this is 100% and the Lily's chocolate was 55%. So that makes a difference. So you're just going to sort of roll it like that. Okay, do you want to do one, dear? Okay, yeah. now remember to hold it like this, okay? Wait a minute, let mommy show you. There you go. All right, mommy's going to tilt it. There, no. Okay, for a three-year-old, that's not too bad. Good job. Or she had to try a little bit and she has to show by her mustache okay we have two different kinds here now you see the lilies and then the one that we made up ourselves. as you can see the one we made up ourselves is hardening a little bit nicer quicker but we're gonna put these in the refrigerator and we're gonna let them harden. okay so we put them in the refrigerator for about 15 minutes and as you can see, the ones where we made the homemade, look at that, really nice and hard and already. Now the Lily ones, which I've never tried the Lily product before, it would need to be hardened a little bit longer. So, but I, I think it would eventually harden, but it's not as professional looking or solid looking as this. But I'm sure it tastes just as good, so let's try it. Here is our taste tester here, and she's been wanting to test it for, well, the last 15 minutes. What? Yeah, she'll get one of them too. You have to try one of each, okay? So can you take a bite of this first? Okay. Here's the napkin. What do you think? Nice. It's nice? Yeah? Can you look at the audience and say it's nice? Nice. It's and nice? I want to be doing it. <laughs> Would you want to eat more of it? Yeah? Okay. Now let's try the other one. Okay, let's get a little one. Okay. Wow, and look at how nice that is. Doesn't leave any residue on our parchment paper. Okay. Try our homemade one. Mm -hmm. 
Is that one nice too? Which one do you like better? Ah, so from the three-year-old, the homemade ones, which is the cheaper version, by the way, is better than the little version. However, if you do want a, a chocolate bar or you want to make uh, chocolate chip fat bombs or something like that on the keto way of living, then of course the Lily product is a good product. But it looks like for the chocolate covered strawberries, make your own and save money. They're like $4.99 for four of them at the store. And we can eat our chocolate covered strawberries. So I don't know if these are going to make it to Valentine's Day, which is uh, less than a few hours away. Huh? What do you think? Should we eat them all tonight? Huh? Should we eat them all tonight? No. Yeah. No? Should we save some for tomorrow? <laughs> and she says no. Okay, what do we tell the audience? Do we tell them happy? Happy Valentine's Day. Valentine's Day. Valentine's Day. Happy Valentine's Day. Hope you guys have a good day tomorrow. Hi, my name is Lori yeah. and this is Laura yeah. and we have a cooking show called Lori and Laura yeah. and uh, if you would like to watch our videos if you could subscribe up here and if you like what you see then down here is the links to watch more videos. Yeah. We hope you like it and uh, are entertained. Yeah. Have a good day.